Mike mentioned this morning um, reading some of the CDF, or excuse me, Cal Fire green sheets, um, and uh, and also you guys just mentioned the secret list. Um, do you think that do you think that your experiences with reading other people talk? And, and you also mentioned Chief Brunacini. Um, do you think that those that those uh, created an opportunity within the culture to say, yeah, we can do the same thing. In other words, do you, do you think it influenced how you guys viewed the situation that you you read Cal Fire Green Sheets, you get the secret list emails? I think also going to uh, the Safety Officer Conference in San Diego, which was new to us. Uh, Chief Summers had been there before. We had the ability to sit there and watch presentations uh, by chief officers or battalion chiefs that had been involved in investigations present uh, the issue, whatever happened, and with that information, we felt more emboldened to do that here within our own department. And by seeing that, um, going to that uh, outside type of training or conferences, I think that helped us to gain a healthy respect that this is a good thing, because we learned a lot from seeing that firsthand and hearing the firsthand, uh, the firsthand, um, eyewitness experience of the incident and that that greatly influenced us definitely our first year the the one thing though that i think uh does still bother me a lot is you'll go to conferences like the safety officers or others yeah and you'll have a uh, a discussion or you'll hear the presentation and then you have the opportunity later on to talk and you find out still there's a lot of backstory that that wasn't talked about and yeah. i really think that we as a culture need to continue to work real hard at, at being real honest. You know, we're, we're deathly afraid of lawyers and deathly afraid of, of being sued, and yet we're missing so important lessons, so many important lessons uh, because of that fear. And uh, I think we, we need to overcome that within the fire service culture. And there again, with this particular incident, we were kind of... Uh, uh, very committed real early on to being very frank about what we found and, and sharing whatever we found. Do you have any suggestions for other folks that might be thinking about something like this? Uh, ways to overcome that fear? Or is it, and it almost sounds like it's, uh, you just dive right in. <laughs> you, have take, you have to take that leap of faith. Yeah. 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 That's, that's, you have to just step right into it. Yeah. And I like the term you used, you know, keep it within the family. Yeah. You know, this is family business. Um, we have to get past that, you know. We have to, we have to share those, those dark secrets. Yeah. So you decide, at some, at some point, um, 